Today, we're doing our biggest opening we've done yet. Today, we're opening up 2,500 charm stones in one sitting. This represents over a hundred million diamond value, and I don't even know why I'm doing it. Our last charm stone opening went so bad, we lost so many diamonds. Since that time, the charm stone prices have plummeted. One contributing factor that has contributed to why the charm stones are so cheap now is because the charm stone just drops from breakables like it's nothing. Especially if you are using super drops, you get a charm stone like every five seconds, it seems like. That might be dramatic, but you do get a lot of them. As you guys can see, we have the 2,500 charm stones, 105 million wrap worth. I have a bow to pick with these charm stones. In my last opening, I didn't get a single royalty charm, but we only opened, I think, 300 of them. Honestly, I can't really remember how much, but these were worth a lot more back then. So that's kind of the difference between that video and this one. And the reason I'm doing this is because I actually have a theory that these might be worth opening now. As you guys can see, the royalty charm is selling for a whopping 7.7 .7 million diamonds each. That is an insane amount. And the overload charm is selling for 5.8 million. The only downside is that the glittering charm is now a third of the price. This used to be a million diamonds, but now it's 320k. So pretty much we just need to get lucky and get a bunch of these royalty charms or a bunch of the overload charms. But I have faith. Overall though, this is a really stupid opening. So if you appreciate this type of content, please leave a like on the video and subscribe to the channel. We do stuff like this all the time. And if you want to enter my giveaways, I do giveaways every single day on my Discord. Link will be down in the description. It's absolutely free. Come join our community. And yeah, let's get right into it though because we have a lot of these things to open and I'm getting really nervous. Some of you guys might think I'm rich, but 100 million diamonds is a lot. I can't afford to lose 100 million diamonds. One good thing about opening these is that these charm chisels and the charm hammers are dirt cheap now. Thank god these didn't turn out to be a pay to win item that big games put in the game. This is a rare big games W as of recent. That is something I am very happy about. So it is not expensive at all to remove a charm from your huge. So it is very viable to try out different charm loadouts for your pets. So at least these charms I open are going to be pretty useful. As you guys can see, or not see I guess, we don't have any charms in our inventory. The whole category for charms is gone right now. So whatever charms we end up having in our inventory after this is going to be what we get. Unfortunately, there's not some cool animation or thing I can speed up of me opening these charm stones. Again, I hope that big games add something where you can do a cinematic opening of stuff like this. So we're probably just going to follow the same format where we open up about a third of these. And then I'll check in with you and show you what I've gotten so far. And we can see how bad the damage is. I did get most of these charm stones from grinding, but I did have to buy the rest. I've been saving for quite a while. I'm honestly so nervous to open them up. I should have really just sold these, but it's possible we make a profit. I think all of our built up unluckiness from previous videos should come in handy here to give us more luck on this one. Honestly, all I really want is one single royalty charm and I will be happy with this video. All right, so I'm going to begin opening this. I will see you guys in a second with the checkup on what we've got so far. All right, and done. So we're basically a third of the way in. I haven't looked yet to see what we've gotten. As you guys can see, we have 800 new items. That's 800 charms. 800 chances at getting a royalty charm. All right, let's see what we got. All right, so, so we didn't get it. So we did not get a royalty or an overload in the first 800 charm stones. 800 of them. But we did get 10 glittering charms. I don't know why you guys let me do this. That was like 30 million worth of charm stones that we just opened. And we got 3 million worth of glittering, 500k diamonds, 250k TNT, 400k worth of critical, 400k worth of strength. The only good news is that that these do sell over wrap a lot of times. So hopefully we could get more for these than the wrap value. But we took a huge loss on those first 800 charms. This was actually more painful than I thought. I should have learned my lesson the first time around. I can't believe I'm doing this to myself again. I thought they'd be better now. I thought they would be better. 800 charms? 800 charms and we don't get one royalty, one overload? All right. No crying, no cry baby, because we're about to get 
the most amount of royalty charms possible from these next 800, all right? I'll see you guys in a second. Pray for me. Okay, so we did another 800. As you can see, we now have 1,600 new items, so... 1600 charm stones we've opened so far please don't do me dirty preston please okay 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 wait 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 chill out 29 oh okay, wait so we doubled we got double the amount of glittering charms that we got last time and we also got a royalty and an overload i will take that i will definitely take that i am very happy with that we are still down an enormous amount, though. So, Preston, I'm going to need you to keep clutching up here. We're going to need about 20 more of these if we're going to break profit on this opener. Oh, my gosh. I don't know why I was so happy about these glittering charms. I really feel like they're going to buff these eventually because I don't see why they didn't buff the glittering charm if they were going to buff the drop rates of the latest area. I feel like stuff like this should be buffed in the same way. Like, it, I feel like everything should be moving in the same direction. So I would like to see a buff of these. Honestly, I'm just going to keep them. I think they're more useful than ever especially if they decide to buff them. So I'm just, it's going to be my gamble. I'm going to hold on to these for a while. I still have a lot. Before the update, I invested in some of these. So I've lost a lot on these glittering charms, but I am so happy we finally got a royalty and an overload. Let's get into it. We have 900 more. I will see you guys in a second with the final results. All right, our last of the charm stones. 105 million worth. All right, guys, don't, don't do it. Don't do it to me. We opened exactly 2,500 charm stones for this moment. And the big reveal, I mean, we got another 20 glittering charms and we got another royalty and another overload charm. There's absolutely no way we even came close to a profit. Honestly, honestly, I did it to myself. I don't know what I expected. I don't know what I thought changed, but I'm just happy we at least got some royalty charms. We actually didn't lose as much as I thought because these are 11, 15, 15, so 40. So this is like 41 right there, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46. We basically, we basically made half of our diamonds back with these charms. If we get a glittering buff, I think we could see a profit with these. I'm gonna hold on to the glittering charms, just hoping Big Games does something about them and makes them better. Overall, not the biggest L. Ratio-wise, I'm pretty sure we lost a lot more in the last video, so this is a big W in my opinion. I got all the charms all over my face. If you guys enjoyed this type of content, please like the video. It is painful sometimes doing these big openings to lose so much. Remember to join the Discord for daily giveaways. We're giving away a huge right now as I speak. So get in there to join up on that giveaway, and I will see you later. Peace out.